Welcome to the Elective Rotation Podcast, Critical Care Pharmacy Minute, where I discuss one critical care pharmacy thought in about one minute. I'm Pharmacy Joe of PharmacyJoe.com. Injectable olanzapine is labeled in the United States for intramuscular use only, but intravenous administration is often preferred to IM due to a faster onset of action and less patient discomfort. Several studies suggest that olanzapine may be given IV without additional risk. A multi-center randomized controlled trial in Australian emergency departments published in 2013 demonstrated that 5 mg of IV olanzapine was as safe as 5 mg of IV droperidol. A prospective observational trial in emergency department patients published in 2016 found no significant safety difference between patients receiving IM and IV olanzapine. Monitoring for arrhythmia and QTC prolongation occurred in most patients in these studies. Occasionally, when parenteral olanzapine appears to be the best choice of medication for a patient, I will recommend IV over IM administration. For links to the studies discussed in this episode, go to PharmacyJoe.com slash episode 241.